Some things on Earth just don't make sense, no matter how many PhDs you throw at them. From blood red rain to an entire river that boiled overnight, these aren't myths or urban legends, these are real, verified natural events that defy every explanation science has thrown at them. In this video, we're diving headfirst into the most bizarre, terrifying, and unexplainable natural mysteries ever recorded. And spoiler alert, even the smartest people in the room have no idea what's really going on. One morning in Jodhpur, India, the sky didn't just thunder, it screamed. On December 18th, 2012, residents across the city heard a deafening explosion from the sky. No aircraft, no weather systems, no military activity, just a massive ear-splitting boom that shook homes and rattled windows. The sound lasted for nearly five seconds and was heard over a wide radius. Here's where it gets really creepy. Scientists, meteorologists, and even defense agencies investigated and came up with absolutely nothing. No seismic activity, no sonic booms, no atmospheric anomalies. Some compared the sound to what's heard before meteor impacts, except no impact was ever found. To this day, no one knows what caused the Jodhpur boom. There's a river deep in the Amazon that literally boils alive anything that falls in it and it shouldn't exist. Located in the Peruvian rainforest, the Chenay Timpishka, or Boiling River, reaches temperatures up to 2,000 degrees Fahrenheit, or 93 degrees Celsius. That is hot enough to kill small animals instantly. What's bizarre is that boiling rivers are typically found near volcanoes or geothermal hotspots, but this one isn't near either. Andreas Ruzo, a geophysicist, studied it in 2011, and and confirmed. There is no volcanic activity to explain the heat. Local legends speak of the river being sacred, protected by spirits. Scientists are still baffled. What heats this water so intensely remains a mystery. Lightning is supposed to strike downward, but in Oklahoma, it decided to go up. On a stormy May evening in 2010, a NASA aircraft studying thunderstorms captured something shocking. Gigantic bolts of lightning shooting upward from the cloud tops into space. These are now known as gigantic jets, but here's the catch. Even after multiple recordings, scientists still can't fully explain how or why these massive lightning bolts leap 50 miles up into the atmosphere. They behave nothing like typical lightning and challenge everything we thought we knew about electrical storms. What if I told you there's a place on Earth where lightning strikes up to 260 nights a year for 10 straight hours a night? That is a lake in Venezuela home to the Catatumbo lightning. This freak weather system produces more than a million lightning bolts a year, and it's been going on for centuries. What causes it? Well, that's the puzzle. Scientists have a few theories heat, moisture, mountain ranges, but none can explain why it's this intense and this consistent. It's like Earth's own version of a haunted electrical storm. Imagine stepping outside and seeing red rain pouring from the sky. Sounds kind of like a horror movie. Right? Well, it actually happened twice. In the Indian state of Kerala, red colored rain fell for weeks in 2001 and again in 2012. Initial theories ranged from dust storms to algae, but lab tests found something even stranger. Red particles with cell-like structures, but no DNA. That led to a wild theory from some researchers that the particles could be extraterrestrial in origin. While that's still debatable, no conclusive natural explanation has ever been agreed on. The skies remain one of the weirdest weather events in modern history. In the remote tundra of Siberia, the ground itself suddenly exploded open, forming massive, perfectly round craters. The first of these sinkholes was discovered in 2014, some as deep as 100 feet. Scientists initially blamed melting permafrost, but that didn't account for the explosive force or the strange shape. Later studies showed the craters were likely caused by underground methane gas igniting under pressure, but no one's fully sure what triggers these massive blasts. One of the craters was even large enough to fit a helicopter. These natural time bombs are still appearing, and they've got researchers deeply concerned. What if you could hear a low, constant hum and 
no one else could. In the small town of Taos, New Mexico, hundreds of residents report hearing a mysterious humming sound day and night. The problem? No known source can be found. No machines, no underground pipelines, nothing. The phenomenon, nicknamed the Taos Hum, has been studied since the early 1990s. Some say it's tinnitus, others blame electromagnetic interference, but the hum is directional and people report being able to move closer or farther away from it. It's been picked up in other parts of the world too, from the UK to Australia, but there is still no clear explanation. Giant rocks, some weighing hundreds of pounds, mysteriously move across the desert floor, leaving trails behind them. Welcome to Racetrack Playa in Death Valley. These sailing stones have baffled scientists for decades. The rocks appear to move entirely on their own, often in different directions as if pushed by an invisible hand. In 2014, researchers finally observed thin ice sheets combined with wind slowly dragging the stones, but not all the stones moved at the same time, and some trails changed direction mid-movement. Something even their model couldn't explain. The mystery isn't entirely solved, some still believe there's more going on beneath the surface. In 2011, a group of treasure hunters stumbled across something at the bottom of the Baltic Sea, and no one knows what it is. At nearly 200 feet wide, the object looks like a crashed UFO, complete with right angles, symmetrical features, and even what some believe are stairs. It became known as the Baltic Sea Anomaly. When sonar images went viral, scientists rushed to explain it away as a rock formation, but here's the real kicker. Some dive teams reported electronics malfunctioning near the site. Geological surveys come back inconclusive, others argue it's just a glacial rock, but until someone recovers a sample or maps it properly, it remains one of the strangest underwater discoveries ever. In a rare celestial twist, the sun rose two days early in Greenland, and no one's quite sure why. On January 13th, 2021, residents were shocked when the sun appeared 48 hours earlier than expected after the polar night. Normally, they don't see the sun rise again until January 15th. Some scientists speculated it might have been due to unusual atmospheric refraction caused by melting ice, others blamed shifting horizons, but even these explanations didn't account for the full effect. Locals described the phenomenon as deeply unsettling, like time had reset itself. Whether it was an optical illusion or something more cosmic, it left scientists digging through models for answers and coming up short. Nature is supposed to follow rules, laws of physics, weather patterns, predictable outcomes, but clearly, it doesn't always get the memo. From boiling rivers with no volcanic source to unexplained sounds from the sky, these natural events remind us how little we actually understand about our planet. And maybe, just maybe, some things aren't meant to be understood. <laughs>